Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. My name is Kayla, aka The Vacationer Kiki, and today I wanted to talk about something pretty interesting, and that is all of the different types of staterooms that are available on the brand new Disney Wish Cruise. I just got back from my cruise about two weeks ago and I'm still dreaming about my stateroom. It was gorgeous. But I think this video will be especially helpful for folks who are thinking about planning a cruise but aren't sure what types of rooms are available or which type of room is right for them. Before we begin, I would love it if you could subscribe to my channel. And if you enjoy this video, please give it a thumbs up. Thank you so much. Of course, as always, if you're looking for help planning your next Disney vacation, including Disney Cruise, please visit us at vacationair.com slash YouTube. Now, if you've stayed in a Disney resort before, whether at Walt Disney World or Disneyland or really any Disney property, you know that Disney designs their rooms with families in mind. Disney rooms in general are designed with the comfort of the guest at the forefront, and Disney Wish state rooms are no different. At the end of a long day, guests can retreat back to their room and just enjoy a beautiful oasis of Disney comfort. Each and every stateroom aboard the Disney Wish features subtle decorative touches of those Disney animated films that we all know and love. I also found the technological advances in the staterooms to be pretty impressive. You really feel as though the Disney Wish is a brand new ship, designed with the utmost comfort in mind. So let's get into selecting your stateroom and the different types available. So there are four main categories that encompass different room types aboard the Disney Wish, and those also include different deck locations, so let's get into it. First, let's talk about the concierge category of rooms aboard the Wish, which are the most luxurious accommodations which showcase premium amenities and services. We have the concierge one-story royal suite with veranda. This is where you can escape to sprawling quarters boasting extravagant details and first-class amenities inspired by the classic elegance of Sleeping Beauty. The plush furnishings and soft, dreamlike palette of blues and golds inspired by Aurora's time in the castle, along with dark, rich wood tones and stone accents evoking her life as Briar Rose, really give you that sense of Disney magic. In the concierge one-story royal suite with Veranda Stateroom, the classifications are as follows. You'll be on deck 10, and you will have two main bedrooms, three full bathrooms, including two main bathrooms with double sinks and a guest bathroom with a shower. One of the main bathrooms features a bathtub with a rain shower, and the other has a walk-in rain shower. You'll have your own private veranda with a whirlpool, a very large living area, and an open dining salon. This suite also has a pantry and wet bar stocked with water and sodas and a walk-in closet in both main bedrooms. The concierge one-story royal suite with veranda sleeps six and is approximately 1,507 square feet, including the veranda. Some of the amenities are including but not limited to a custom premium plush Eurotop mattress, 1,000 thread count sheets, luxury bathrobes for each person in the stateroom, a 43-inch LCD flat screen TV with remote, full-length mirror, Sub-Zero wine cooler, mini in-room safe in each of the main bedrooms, hair dryer, and phone with voicemail. It is worth mentioning that guests of the concierge suites and staterooms enjoy an expanded range of offerings including down duvets, choice of hypoallergenic, feather, or therapeutic memory foam pillows, your very own personal robe and slippers, and complimentary Wi-Fi. Now the concierge services begin before you board the ship and continue throughout your vacation and beyond. You're able to pre-reserve many of the onboard activities and services online up to 120 days prior to your sale date, and you may also inform the concierge team of your preferences 130 days prior to sailing, and they will make all of those bookings on your behalf when the 120-day booking window opens. There is a dedicated concierge agent available Monday through Saturday, 8.30 a.m. to 5.30 p.m. for personalized assistance in planning every cruise detail. And as a concierge guest, you'll enjoy exclusive access to dedicated areas on the ship, including the concierge lounge. Located amid the concierge suites on deck 12 forward, this stylish modern retreat allows guests to relax in quiet comfort, sip a cocktail or a coffee, and access the internet. 
This is really truly a VIP experience and one that I will be booking in the very near future. The next category of staterooms that we'll be talking about are the deluxe ocean view staterooms with verandas. I was able to stay here on my Disney cruise and I gotta tell you, it was spectacular. I actually stayed in a deluxe family ocean view stateroom with a veranda, which was approximately 284 square feet, including the veranda, and it came along with a queen bed, single convertible sofa, upper berth single pull down bed, and a single wall pull down. There are some rooms that sleep five. The amenities in these rooms include custom premium plush Eurotop mattress, 300 thread count sheet, bath towels, 43 inch LCD flat screen TV, full length mirror, as well as much more. The veranda is very airy and private and a true sanctuary where you can watch the sunrise or just bask in the ocean breezes. Helpful hint, if you're looking for a larger veranda, select stateroom category 4E on deck 6, 9, or 10. Your private balcony comes equipped with patio furniture, deck lighting, plexiglass railings and dividers, as well as childproof locks. As a Disney kid at heart, I really delighted in the celestial scene featuring original artwork and an enchanting message from the fairy godmother reveals itself when the upper berth bed is pulled down. Don't miss it. Our next category are the deluxe ocean view staterooms aboard the Disney Wish. This is where you can catch breathtaking views from the porthole window of your well-appointed quarters. These staterooms sleep three to four guests and are approximately 218 square feet. You have a queen bed, a single convertible sofa, upper berth single pull-down bed, or single wall pull-down bed if sleeping four, and queen bed and sleeper sofa. The amenities include all of those that we've listed above as well as a porthole to see the ocean. The deluxe ocean view staterooms include a TV, desk, and sitting area with couch, a heavy privacy curtain to separate the sitting and sleeping areas in most of them, a split bath, a bathroom with a vanity, sink, shower, and tub with glass door, and a half bathroom with a vanity, sink, and toilet. These beds are so beautiful in these rooms. They're elevated wooden bed frames for underbed storage of suitcases and other large items, really practical, and attractive yet functional cabinetry in the living area. So much closet space and storage area. It's really a great design. And the final category in our Disney Wish Cruise stateroom overview is the standard inside stateroom where you will find more space in the same class rooms than on most other cruise ships. They are superior standard rooms subtly infused with delightful Disney storytelling elements. The standard rooms sleep three to four people are approximately 169 square feet and come with a queen bed, single convertible sofa, and upper berth pull-down bed. Now there is no exterior view in these rooms, but if you're not going to be spending a lot of time in your room, or if this is the sort of room that your budget allows for, it really is all you need. Most of the amenities that we've discussed in previous room types are included in the standard rooms. And as always with Disney, the standard rooms are designed with everything to ensure first-rate comfort and convenience during your voyage. The standard staterooms feature a TV, desk, and sitting area with couch. Again, the heavy privacy curtain to separate the sitting and sleeping areas. A full bathroom with vanity sink, shower, and tub. And those beautiful beds and attractive yet functional cabinetry. I really hope this video has helped break down for you the different types of rooms aboard the Wish Cruise. I can't wait to get back on board. From my Disney Wish Cruising family to yours, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And if you need help planning your next Walt Disney World vacation, please reach out to us at vacationeer.com YouTube. And of course, remember, if we can dream it, we can do it. Bye for now.